Imagine a world without mosquitoes, no more itchy bites or buzzing annoyances. But what if we actually removed all mosquitoes from the planet? Would it solve more problems than it creates? Let's dive into this intriguing scenario. How do mosquitoes affect human health? What would happen if mosquitoes disappeared? How could we get rid of mosquitoes? Wondering about these questions. Stick around because of what Globamind will provide you with all the answers. Ecosystem Impacts Mosquitoes are a vital food source for many animals. For example, a single bat can consume up to 1,000 mosquitoes in just one hour. Birds, fish, and frogs also rely on mosquitoes as part of their diet. Mosquito larvae play a helpful role in nature by feeding on decaying matter in water. This includes algae, fungi, and bacteria. Their feeding helps to keep water bodies clean and healthy. In Alaska, the Arctic tern, a saya bird, feeds on mosquitoes during its breeding season. Without mosquitoes, these birds might struggle to find enough food for themselves and their chicks. Mosquito larvae are so efficient at cleaning water that they are used in some wastewater treatment systems to help break down organic matter. Human Health Impact Mosquitoes are the deadliest animals on Earth. They spread diseases like malaria, dengue fever, Zika virus, and more. These diseases kill over one million people every year worldwide. If mosquitoes were eradicated, diseases like malaria could be wiped out. Malaria alone infects over 200 million people each year, so eliminating mosquitoes could save many lives. In the early 20th century, malaria was a major problem in countries like the United States. Through efforts to control mosquito populations, malaria was eliminated from the U.S. by the 1950s. Malaria is caused by a parasite that is transmitted to humans through the bites of infected mosquitoes. The parasite multiplies in the liver and then infects red blood cells, causing symptoms like fever, chills, and flu-like illness. Methods of eradicate. Scientists have created genetically modified mosquitoes that are unable to reproduce. When these GM mosquitoes mate with wild mosquitoes, the offspring die before reaching adulthood. This method can help reduce mosquito populations over time without harming other species. Insecticides are chemicals used to kill mosquitoes. While effective, they can also harm other insects such as bees and butterflies and have negative impacts on the environment. Some mosquitoes have also developed resistance to certain insecticides, making them less effective in controlling mosquito populations. In some parts of the world, like Brazil and the Cayman Islands, GM mosquitoes have been released as part of mosquito control programs. These efforts have shown promising results in reducing mosquito populations and controlling the spread of diseases like dengue fever. The use of insecticides to control mosquitoes dates back to the 1940s when the pesticide DDT was widely used. However, due to its harmful effects on the environment and wildlife, DDT was banned in many countries in the 1970s and 1980s. Consequences of Mosquito Eradicant Mosquitoes are an important food source for many animals, including fish, birds, and bats. If mosquitoes were eliminated, these animals would have less food, which could disrupt the food chain and impact the populations of other species. Some animals, like the endangered northern quoll in Australia, rely on mosquitoes as a food source. Without mosquitoes, these animals could struggle to find enough food, which could further endanger their populations. Mosquitoes have been around for more than 100 million years and are found on every continent except Antarctica. They have adapted to various environments and play a unique role in ecosystems around the world. While getting rid of mosquitoes might seem like a good idea, it could have unintended consequences. We need to consider the impact on ecosystems and other animals that depend on mosquitoes. As we work towards controlling mosquito-borne diseases, we must tread carefully to avoid causing more harm than good. What are your thoughts on this topic? Do you think we should try to eliminate mosquitoes or are the risks too high? Let us know in the comments below 